Good morning to uh, Bolkis Halasni. Good morning, Bolkis. Good morning, Adam. How are you? Very good. Joining us on the telephone from Knowledge Oman. Lovely to have you with us uh, one, once again. It's been a little while since we spoke, I think, isn't it? Very true. And I miss really having a conversation with you. Oh, we miss having a conversation with you because you've got a lovely, fresh voice and you've always got a fabulous um, outlook on, on life and always very, very positive. Thank you. Now, the Knowledge Oman team, tell us a little bit about the Knowledge Oman team and how people could get involved. All right. Now, um, first of all, good morning to everybody. Um, Knowledge Oman is an award-winning platform, knowledge sharing platform. Mm. It was founded in 2008 by Barak Berwani. Hello, Tarek. Now, the basic vision of our platform was simply to support the late majesty vision and turning Oman into a knowledge-based society. Okay. With all of that, we do it in order to equip the youth with the right skills and the right exposure to the knowledge where they can flourish in their life personally or professionally or they can even start up their own businesses. Now, you're back to your question when you said how to join, yeah. then I would just say simply go to knowledge Oman, www.knowledgeoman.com where there is a form for anyone to uh, um, ask to, to, to join the platform. Okay. Okay. And that can be anybody. It doesn't have to be Omanis. It could be uh, any expats as well, interested. Well, exactly. Now, the, the beauty about Knowledge Oman is that it really uh, gets people together, regardless be it Omani or non-Omani. In fact, our platform is a multicultural platform. You will find Omanis, non-Omanis, and because of COVID also, they are overseas. So some of them, they are not really like, you know, in Oman. So that's oh. the beauty thing about Knowledge Oman. And you're very high tech. I, I know that with uh, yourselves and Tarek. And I've seen a number of your uh, recent uh, live streams. And you, you're, you're multilingual, bulky, aren't you? At least three different languages <laughs> I spotted. That's absolutely incredible. Yeah, well, oh. try. <laughs> it's amazing. That's true. Now tell us, uh, there's uh, changing leadership in in Knowledge Oman in the organi organization in the uh, after two years. What does this mean, um, and uh, what are the uh, leading leaders' roles? Uh, that's a very good question. Now I really need to first talk about um, the leadership itself. Now leadership really it's not about getting a lot of followers, but as they say, is being able to make another leader. So in Knowledge Oman, we give this opportunity to work and lead teams, and it's something that brings value to the leadership development in, in our country. Mm -hmm. Now, for example, Tariq Hilal, when he first, Tariq Hilal Berwani, when he first started KO in 2008, yeah. he built a team of passionate followers, but then he gave the opportunity to others to take his place and become leaders. For me personally, Adam, I'm so happy to be given this opportunity to lead, and I will also follow same path as he did uh, to create more leaders uh, who can take my place and benefit the, the country in a greater way. And you're very, very, very good at putting this uh, over. And you're very, very uh, professional in, in this way. But um, I've got to tell you, the listener, we're with Balkis Halhasni. Um, Balkis has just been voted in as president of Knowledge Omar. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Madam Adam. President. And it's an honor to be honest, but with that comes the responsibility. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm the sixth, to be honest, the sixth leader, uh, president of, of Knowledge Oman. Okay. But I'm the first Omani woman to, to lead the platform. We did have a, a, a woman leader, her name is Reem Awadir, who did exceptionally beautiful work with the platform. And I'm hoping to go through the same path and, you know, add value to the platform and to the country and hope. We've got the team assembled here in Studio One of Oman FM this morning. Wishing congratulations to you, Balkis, on becoming the president. Thank you, Hooray! 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 Thank you guys. I'm honored. Thank you. We're talking knowledge, Oman. We're talking moving forward. We're talking leadership. Let's just look back at the uh, recent times. How has the coronavirus impacted? your well your social activities and how have you overcome them 
Now, when it comes to COVID, to be honest, it had impacted a lot of sectors, especially when it comes to the business sectors and stuff. But one thing about knowledge, knowledge is just unstoppable. If you notice, for the past few months, the number of webinars all over the world is just exceptionally yeah. beautiful, which again says that knowledge will never be stopped because of whatsoever reason. And and, and, and knowledge of mine in, in particular, if I may say, yeah. uh, everything went now from whatever we used to do on ground, it has to move now online. And that's why we launched what's known as KO webinars. Now, effect of COVID-19 did not really stop us from continuing to make difference mm. to the society. But this time, we tend to use technology. In, mm. in KO webinar in, in specific, what we did was just to get people from different fields who are passionate in sharing knowledge. Okay. And it's a series of virtual interviews with experienced industry, academic experts, professional leaders, and various topics that contribute mm. to the development of the country. Mm. Now, the good thing about KO webinar, and I personally find it as a very innovative thing, that we did not only attract the locals, but we were also able to get some international speaker mm. into the platform where they have shared their knowledge in different aspects of personal life or professional. And it was conducted every two weeks for an hour show. And the registration was open for all, and it was free for those who are seeking knowledge. It's uh, it's incredible, really, to see all the positive things that have come out of this uh, dreadful business with the pandemic. And, and thank you for sharing once again um, all your passion with us. Just in closing, uh, Volkis, President Volkis, um, <laughs> are, you, are you able to uh, shed any light um, as far as the platforms that you've been using on the webinars, um, the, so the actual applications, the, the software on your computers, any Anything in particular that you're able to share with us about um, the software use or the types of software or any names of software which you found particularly useful for this purpose? Well, to be honest, we've been using different kind of platform. We started we started off with Instagram Live right. as, as a platform for all our webinars. Then we moved to Zoom. We moved to the Streamlined where... It was all a live session in our different platforms, YouTube channels or oh, yeah. LinkedIn or Facebook. And um, the good thing about, to be honest with the COVID-19, is give us exp exposure to those platforms that they were mm. there but never used before. Yeah. And we started now to build into those platforms things that we can utilize to make even our streamline and our live session even a better, uh, uh, you know, like better session. Have you guys looked at uh, using more than one platform at the same time, Bulkies? Yes, that's exactly what we have done. We've used our LinkedIn, we use the Facebook Live, and wow. uh, we use also our Twitter. And now the, uh, the next move is also to get the Instagram with the leadership of uh, Tony, uh, who is the, our uh, head of technology in, in Knowledge Oman. So we're working hard now with that part as well. Fantastic speaking to you, uh, Knowledge Oman, uh, listening to your future directions and future plans, uh, your reshuffling and your election as President, Balkis Alasni. Great speaking to you. Have a great day. Uh, talk to you again soon, can we? Thank you, Adam, for this lovely chat, and I wish you and all the listeners a lovely day. Thank you. Congratulations. Congratulations. <laughs> Especially for you, Balkis, this morning, and our friends at Knowledge Oman. Love and meet from all of us here. Good morning to you. Oman FM, your nation's state.